You got it, girl. Oh, that's... Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's a hub. There's a mouth. You're a good girl. All right. Keep pushing. It's coming. Oh, you got it, girl. Let's see the one. Oh, there's two. It's positioned properly. You're good. arms out for you, girl. Okay. Come on, keep pushing. Come on. Good girl. I'll help you. There we go. You got it. Good job. Hi. Oh. That baby looks like it's daddy, doesn't it? That's a legend baby. That's a boy. He's a buck kind of year, I guess. Good job. Good job. What is that? Big kids. Okay, let me see. All right, guys, so I'm gonna skip the intro there, but Dinky here is doe number seven uh, to give birth out of the 22 that we bred this year. Um, and this is her first time. Uh, so she has not had babies yet. I can tell she's got one more in here at least. I can fill it. Um, but yeah, so she was bred to legend. Uh, she did. I'm really, really excited about this doe because it is a Vader daughter. So, and her udder just really, really is looking lovely. I'm, I'm really loving it. So excited about this doe. And then we bred her again to legend. And if you can't tell, look at that. So... She did good. Look it. You got a couple moon spots. Oh, and you're pulled. Did good, Mama. You didn't even hesitate. You went right to licking him. So we moved Dinky over here just a couple hours ago. She wasn't really bedding down with super hard contractions at all. Look at that big one. So I just went in the house for a second and you started pushing. Oh, you look like you're about to push out your other one. Oh, 
quickly. Okay. Let me get a towel. Uh, thank you. Sheesh. The second one's always come out easier for sure. Good job. Oh, what's going on here? Oh, it came out. You little stinker. You came out breech. Oh, your lungs are working. I bet you're a boy. You good? <laughs> Let's see. Oh, that's a girl. Yay. What? Hi. There, Mama. Right? These kids are huge. Yeah, this is a little girl. She's done. <laughs> Good job. She came out a lot easier, huh, girl? Oh, he's just cute. Well, Dinky is a champion, a little pro, and if you look over in the pen over there, we got little Miss Vogue, who's also starting to bed down and is in labor. So, Dinky beat you, Vogue. That's okay, though. So pretty. I had some big babies. I don't remember what, I think I was thinking two. Emily, do you remember what our vote was? Uh, I think we, both of us was three. We both thought three? I think so. I don't remember. Maybe you were two. I think you might have been, I don't know. I'll have to look. But I was definitely three. Okay, I was two, I think. I think you're done. Little babies. Oh, a moon spot. Two moon spotted babies. Cool. You did really good, Ma. Don't look in labor. It looks like a very mad goat. That's what labor actually makes you look like. <laughs> like huge kids, man. These guys are just big. No wonder your mama was so big and round. <laughs> Good job. I see neither of them got the blue eyes. I wonder if she's pulled. Doesn't feel like it. I think she might be horned. Oopsie! I get her oh, back end. Oh, cool. It's neat once they get them all dried off. Because when all the moon spots start showing up. That looks like that might be one right there. Just a little guy. One behind her ear there, her right ear. Right here? Yeah. Yep. That's one, yeah, for sure. What did you do?
They're like twice the size of the other babies or something. Is that a peacock? Yeah, I guess. So. <laughs> what the heck was that? <laughs> I'm like a dying owl. Yeah. Where do you think you're going, Missy? They're gonna make you get up on your feet, Mama. You gonna get up, Dinky? They're getting away from you. Oh yeah, I'm right there on the back of the neck too. Wow. Can you stay there, let mama clean you. That's legend. Mm-hmm. Wait. She's a Vader daughter, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, so legend's a moon spot. That's good. Legend did, yeah. He did on these babies. Oh, she's got one on her eye. Wow, Dinky. He's just nibbling her chest. They want you to get up, Mama. You're strong little dudes. Oh. <laughs> How cool is he, huh? They're both really neat. Yeah. So Dinky's dad, Vader, has uh, got some really, really great lines behind him. He's really turning out to be a, a good, a good buck, and I like his kids. And he's really producing some pretty does, huh? Like Dink a Dink. Yes. So anyway, really, really cool lines. Um, really great lines, and then. Vogue over there, even though they look nothing alike, is his full sister. They were actually born the same year, and 
I am super excited about Vogue too. So your aunt is Vogue. <laughs> Just too cute. They want you up, Mama. You're good to get up. You had a really good labor. You want to get up? You want me to convince you? Okay. Not yet. Let's see your other here, girl. Let's go put dirt on it. There you oh, go, Dink. Make there sure. Go, Dink. Man, he's a genius. Well, did you get it already? You don't like that. You gotta let me make sure your teeth are cleared, honey. All right. Let's. Yeah, he's starving. Right there, right there, right there. There. Oh. Oh. Right there. Oh. I'll figure it out. Here, buddy. She'll let you. She just doesn't know what's going on just yet. And you're so <laughs> clumsy with your big old legs. Is he on it? Nope. No. Here, look. There. There. Don't move. Mm. You gotta let him eat. You're good, Mama. There we go. See? Stay there, stay there. Here. I'll put your leg down. Stay there. No? Well, little dude's on it again. Stay, Dinky. You're such a stinker. <laughs> She's gonna make you guys work for it. He knows exactly where he needs to be. Oh, we're not. not. <laughs> she does. There she goes. Dinky. Cut it out. That goes right there. That goes right there. She is not sure about them eating, but she'll let them. She stayed a little bit for the buckling. She so just has to get used to that, huh? Who's right there, girly? Let's see. No, she's way off. So sometimes with the first freshener, just to get them used to it, like if she's gonna try to avoid it for too long or not let them suckle for too long, then you just kind of hold them there and don't let them move. You know, you gotta let the babies eat, and then once they start eating, the mama gets it. And it's like, okay, it's not too bad. Right here, mama. Right there. Right there. Yeah, there you go. She's kind of she's nearly trying to get off of it, but. <laughs> a moon spot on her bum. Right there, right there. Not quite. Right here. <laughs> He's just getting mad. Oh, are you on it? Sounds like he might be. No, he's not. Well, while she's eating, you guys better hurry up and eat, too. There you go. <laughs> you 
nature is a pretty cool thing. He's like an animal, like, you know, first time having babies, you don't even know what the heck is going on. He just get right to cleaning. So, out of the seventh dough, that gives us nine bucks and five doughs. So the bucks are definitely in the lead. So Vogue here does not look like she's that close. Um, so this morning I did notice she was bagged up. That was like one of the first things I saw this morning. It was like, ooh, you can get right. Yes. So she is starting to get just a little bit uncomfortable. But again, she probably has a few hours. I've just seen some really mild contractions. Um, She's actually letting me pet her, but this morning when I was trying to get her to check her ligaments, she was like, get away. Because that's what I do. I check ligaments and they know that that's what I'm coming for and they're like, go away from me. But uh, when they get close, they act a little different. She is squishy ishy in there. Aren't you? So Vogue here, as I mentioned, is Vader's full sister. Um, they have a grandma, it's a great great grandma, <clears throat> in the lines. Uh, her name is Belladonna, and she is the only Nigerian that has won nationals twice. She's just an absolute stunning doe. Has like your coat pattern, really. And so last year, Vogue here, so she's two years old, Vogue is, um, and she was just too tiny. She was out of quads, and they were really, really premature, um, and just was not to size to breed her, um, have her kid out as a yearling. So um, I did hold off, and then she went to the shows um, last year, and she actually won Grand Champion in one of the rings, and she won Reserve Grand Champion in another. Um, so, and I almost didn't take her to that show, and then I was like, you know what, gosh, she's just looking so lovely. And so I shaved her, and uh, was just like, absolutely, had to do it. So she didn't... Um, she, she actually won without really wanting to behave in the ring, so, you know, she, she really did stand out. She's a gorgeous doe. Um, so I've been so excited to see her little udder bump developing, and it's actually pretty big. And you can see medial, um, and I mean, I mean, just even the four udder just looks like it's going to be so smoothly blended. So I'm, I'm really excited about this lovely doe. But this is her first time having babies. It's her first time, huh? You are going to be just fine. This girl is, is a powerhouse. She's super wide. Super wide. First fresheners can be just a little, a little nerve-wracking because they've never had babies before. But, again, that's why I breed my... I like wide does. I like wide. Yes. And you are definitely wide. So you're going to be fine. I don't know. This girl here is pretty round, if you ask me. And she's quite deep bodied as well. Um, last night, I could tell that she had dropped where her the bellies will look so big, like this big circle. And then when they drop, it almost makes them look skinnier. Um, so I, I kind of assume that she might be in labor this morning because she dropped. Ain't that right? But she's being very chill. She's aware she does want to be in this pen. Um, a lot of times, like, babies will trigger, will trigger something, and she doesn't seem to mind about those babies crying at all. So it's like she's got no idea what's about to happen. You will soon know, huh? So we will just keep an eye on this lovely, lovely doe. We're going to have babies. You're going to have some does. How many do you think you got? Emily, do you remember what you said for her? Let me see. I took a picture of it. I took a picture too. <clears throat> so with Dinky, I did guess two. And Emily guessed three. So that means uh, we're, we're like even for guesses now, aren't we, Emily? Uh, for both of us, we guessed both. But yeah, we are even. I guess four for Vogue. So did I. We're totally wrong. We are totally wrong. I don't know, Vogue. Maybe three. 
So we'll we'll see. I guess Emily and I both said four for Vogue. Well, her mom, she was out of quads, weren't you, girl? And so, she looked like she wasn't even. And her right. mom, I was just like, gosh, is she even pregnant? If she didn't have the other bump, I would have never. <laughs> she was so little, and then she had four. And you are not little. Oh, that looks quite uncomfortable. Nothing sunken in. They are getting a little harder on her. Yes. So I did hold her for a bit to let them kind of eat. Because they've been getting on. Um, but she just doesn't let them latch on for too long before she tries to walk away. So... Yeah, so I did just let them do that, and they ate quite a bit, so that's good. She really has a lot of little moon spots. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You got one on your eye like your daddy. She's pretty. And you got a really cool one. Let me see. I'm sorry, girl. Yeah, he is definitely pulled. And you are definitely horned. Like your All right. Lift your arm up. We're going to cut these umbilical cords here. Get that little straw off. Okay. Spray it with iodine. To prevent any infection. This is something I do with all of the kids. When they that's considered an open wound and when they're laying down in the soil and in the dirt, it is susceptible to getting infected with bacteria. And can get them very, very sick with something called joint ill. It's not a pretty thing to have to witness a kid going through, so it's all better. Let's see you. Now you're gonna get mad. Perfection. Lungs are working. Oh, I know. It's not that bad. There we go. You're all right. Dinky's got her babies all cleaned off. She is tuckered out. Little dude here was sleeping, but he just woke up. Now mama's rest time is over. And that little doe there is still taking a nap. They have completely drained the udder. She let them eat, so she did really good. What are you up to, huh? You're taking your sweet time, aren't you? So it's been not quite six hours since she had no ligaments. But she is definitely kind of slow going. You can tell she's starting to get uncomfortable though, huh baby? Yes. We got a lot of babies in there. Good girl. All right, you guys. It is hard to believe that this precious little firstborn girl last year, as tiny as she was, is now a mama. She did so good. She's been taking care of these beautiful babies all day. They're so precious. This little dude, legend left his mark, has a little moon spot, and Dinky passed on the pole gene to him, so he is polled or naturally hornless. And then this pretty little moon spotted doe. Of course he's gonna hide. Can I see you? And she's just got little moon spots all over her. I don't know if you guys can see them.
But yeah, guys, so another successful labor. She did amazing. I'm very proud of her. And as far as Vogue is concerned here, it could go really late into the night, you guys, because she's not even showing any hard contraction. So I'm going to keep an eye. Um, but yeah, as of now, we're going to wrap this up and uh, just keep an eye out. So thank you guys so much for watching. We will see you soon.